Uh, not really. I felt a lot better than last night. Uh, hopefully, I get the same progress tomorrow. And, uh, should be good, good to go here real soon. What's the biggest hindrance for you right now as far as Ample's concerned? What's that? What's the biggest hindrance, the thing that you can't really do that you're used to doing at this point? It's just sore. I, I, ain't, I ain't practiced today, so I don't know how I am running on it, but uh, we'll see tomorrow. But it's just sore, that's all. Have you had a sim similar situation like this this season? Not this season, no. But I rolled my ankle in the past. Like, is that, you think it's, it's just, just an ankle roll? Yeah, yeah. It's a mild, very mild sprain. Nothing too bad. What kind of uh, around? Oh, it felt good. I wasn't putting that much pressure on I was just getting some spot shots up, and the uh, shot felt good, so, uh, so it wasn't that bad. What kind of effort is it taking to keep this streak going? Like? It's just great focus. Uh, every night we're getting our opponent's best shot, so it just takes great focus, honestly. Coach said he, even he's exhausted, and he's not even playing a minute. Is it mentally taxing not out there? Not really. It's still early in the season, and uh, it's not too bad because we're so deep, and uh, you know, if we had a short rotation, it would be both. You know, we play 9, 10, 11, 12 guys, so that's what helps us so much. Do you have the confidence now that only you and your team can beat yourself? Uh, yeah, I mean, if we're on our game, we're playing unselfish, and we're, uh, and we're focused, I don't think really any team's going to beat us unless they play an amazing game. But uh, it's gonna ha we're going to lose. It's going to happen. It's a long season. But uh, if we're on our game, they're really tough to stop. Players, we spent a lot of talk about Records all great, you know, but at the end of the year, if we end up lost, there we go. Uh, I hope so. He's a great guy. He's a great friend. Clay, is uh, Steph better than he was last year? I mean, there's a lot of talk outside that he might even be most improved player. You play alongside of him. Is he better? No, man, he got worse. <laughs> no, I mean, in what, way, what, in what ways better, is he man. better? Man? His efficiency. Uh, just look at the numbers. You know, the scoring efficiency is crazy. His true shooting percentage is something that has been done since Will. So, uh, and just his overall feel for the game and the pace he plays at, he's just at another level right now. Do you notice the difference on the court in the game when he's on versus he's off? Well, he hasn't been off that much, so no, I don't really notice. Yeah. To be honest, I've not seen him off the I mean, when he's not playing, when he's not playing, the different uh, on, the, on the court for, you, for him as a leader versus. You having a full team and everybody wants yeah. to Yeah, obviously we're not the same team without him on the floor. He's an MVP, but um, we're still a great team without him. But he elevates us to being something special. So, uh, you know, but um, yeah, there's a big difference, you know. He's one of the best players in the world. Clay, how do you kind of try to enjoy this kind of run? I mean, the fact that. I mean, this, this backcourt will be talked about for years to come after you retire. How do you kind of take that in and also understand there's a game and you got to play and it's all serious? Just got to live in the moment and embrace every game. There's a lot of them. Uh, you can't get hung up what you did in the past. You just got to, you know, work every day and go one day at a time and we'll be successful if we do that. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you guys.